click the bell icon to get latest videos from ikeda hello friends welcome back to the subject of machine design one we are right now learning about various aspects which actually affect the fluctuating load design our today's topic is about the not sensitivity a small topic which is actually hampering the design students notch is uh, is an imperfection that is present deliberately or by mistake in a product in such a case that the endurance limit will have a different value as compared to the product which has no notch but it was estimated and it was found that the actual reduction that takes place in the endurance limit of course whenever the imperfection remain present the endurance limit will definitely come down let me quickly remind you that the endurance limit is the maximum amount of stress that the given component may sustain in given conditions of fatigue failure so the actual amount of stress that it may handle comes down considerably whenever there is an inclusion of notch takes place but it was found that this particular reduction was much smaller than it was estimated by the factor kt or the stress concentration factor so it was necessary to understand how the notch actually affects this particular design because the estimated value of the endurance limit that was supposed to come down was much much more than the or the estimated value was much much smaller than the actual value that took place and that's why it was found that the endurance limit value or the reduction in that has a sensitivity towards the notch so kf factor that is the stress concentration factor is defined as the endurance limit of notch free specimen divided by the endurance limit of notch specimen now it is very clear that this particular value will have a lower value than the this and that's why this particular factor will always be greater than 1 the next thing is the stress concentration factor is related with the actual material and it relates with the grain size of the material and it was found that finer the grain size the uh, lesser than the kf was but the coarse was the grain size in that case higher was the stress concentration factor was now let us look at this definition it says that the notch sensitivity or notch sensitivity is susceptibility of a material to succumb to the damaging effects of stress raising notches in fatigue loading in short it is the tendency of the body or tendency of the material which has the notch to show the variations in the endurance limit just because the presence of the notch so in that case the factor q which is the notch sensitivity factor is given by the ratio of increase in nominal stress due to the actual things divided by the increase in nominal stress due to the theoretical things so in short this is the actual things which are recorded in the increase in nominal stress that is the endurance limit stress and this is the increase which was predicted by means of theoretical relations now it was found that the increase was much more than that and that's why q will also have a value greater than 1 now it is not about the value of the stress it is about the increase in value of the stress so we know that theoretical value was kt into the maximum stress possible and the actual was kf into the maximum stress possible and therefore the increase in actual one was the kf into maximum minus the maximum and that makes it kf minus 1 into sigma naught whereas the theoretical increase is actually the kt because it is only based on the stress concentration factor so it makes it kt minus 1 into sigma naught so when q was found out it was found that
it was this simple ratio but when we were supposed to find out the kf which is the factor in association it was found that kf is given by 1 plus q times kt minus 1 but we knew that q value will always lie between 0 to 1 it will be of course greater than 0 but it will be smaller than 1 as we have seen in last slide this particular value if we find out we will get that material sensitive to notch if the q value is 1 in that case the value of kf and kt will be same but if the material has no sensitivity towards the notch the value q will have zero value and the kf factor in that case will become one so this is how the notch sensitivity comes into picture and plays a major role when we have to relate with the kf and kt kt is the theoretical value of the factor stress concentration factor and kf is the actual stress concentration factor when we consider the notch sensitivity also in the next session we will look at the different aspects of the finite and indefinite life aspects and how to solve the numerical based on it guys let me tell you that we are looking at different concepts which actually are affecting the design of the components which undergo the cyclic loadings and how the estimated value of stresses are actually coming down or the maximum safe stresses is coming down by means of this factor so that the maximum possible stress value will be much much smaller than the those values in case of static cases thank you so much for watching this video if you like this video please subscribe to ikeda thank you